How's it going everyone? My name is Exotic Gaming and welcome back to Pixel Gun 3D. This is only the second time I've ever used a face cam for Pixel Gun 3D. The last time was in like July 2016 when I did a after anesthesia Pixel Gun 3D gameplay, but uh, a lot of you guys have suggested this, so here we are with another face cam. Hope you guys are excited for this video. We are doing another challenge. If you guys have not checked out the last challenge that I did on this game, highly recommend you guys to do so. It was a fantastic challenge. One of the most difficult ones ever. So I'll link it down below at the top of the description if you guys would like to go check that out. Definitely recommend doing that. But uh, yeah, guys, here we are with another Pixel Gun video. I hope you guys are excited. What we are going to be doing is an inverted colors challenge gameplay. I don't know how the gameplay is going to turn out. I'm just going to let you guys know right off at the very beginning here. I don't generally play Pixel Gun 3D with inverted colors. I got to say, look at my character. He looks really scary with those like just blank white eyes like that. But uh, yeah, should be interesting. Make sure to leave a like down below. I expect every freaking person to watch this who, who watches this to do that because your support determines the future of Pixel Gun 3D on the channel. And um, comment down below other challenges you'd like for me to do on this game. Subscribe if you're new and Let's get into this. So, uh, as you guys will see here, I'm just using a variety of different weapons here. I got the dual shotguns, dead star, zombie head, which, by the way, looks insane. That looks really scary, to be honest. Portable death moon. I got the one shot and the dragon breath. I'm going to switch to different weapons throughout this video, but um, I did want to take the first couple of minutes to talk about something that will have already happened after I posted this video, but... Um, didn't happen yet the time that I am recording this and yes I am recording this video before I am posting this this is a pre-recorded video on September 8th 2017 and I, I'm probably posting this like a week later and uh, that's because well Hurricane Irma is a pretty big problem right now um, it is going to hit my house and I don't know if I'm going to have any power so I am pre-recording videos so I actually have stuff to post in case I do lose my power and I have no way of actually posting and creating things for you. Um, but basically, it's a very, very big hurricane. Probably the biggest and, and most destructive hurricane to hit Florida since um, Hurricane Charlie in 2004. I lived through that. That was definitely not a fun hurricane to live through. And um, yeah, it's uh, pretty insane. So I, I mean, I probably am going to take a couple of minutes here just to talk about exactly. Can I please get this guy? What the heck? You are such a terrible human being. You are, you are, dis, you disgust me. You use your freaking ghost lantern. You're just a terrible pixel gun 3D player. Anyways, um, I'm not going to really worry about that too much because I am going to talk about something pretty important right now. Um, Hurricane Irma. Yeah. So basically, um, this hurricane, guys, is the second strongest hurricane ever in the history of all hurricanes in the Atlantic Ocean. It destroyed islands in the Caribbean so far. It's currently in the Turks of Caicos with 160 mile an hour sustained winds. It's literally like just barely a category five right now. It's been category five longer than every other hurricane in the history of hurricanes in the Atlantic Ocean besides one back in 1932. And uh, yeah, it's it's been a really big storm. It has max sustained winds of can I please get that guy? What is my, is, are my dual shotguns just like the worst things in the entire world? It's, um, it's got maximum sustained winds of 185 miles an hour at its peak with gusts of over 230 miles an hour. Um, and it, it completely destroyed places like the British Virgin Islands, um, places like, uh, Barbuda, the island of Barbuda, which I can tell you guys there, 98% of all the buildings on that entire island were completely destroyed. Um, because it had 185 mile an hour sustained winds for many hours at a time and it just destroyed that island. Most of the people on that island died. Now, it's going to hit South Florida with about 160 mile an hour winds. Um, and I really hope to the people that are watching this that are from South Florida, I mean, I'm already posting this after the fact, but uh, I hope the people that watch this either got out of there, evacuated up to like North Florida, Central Florida, Georgia area, or um, you just, you know, are in a safe area in South Florida because it's going to be bad. It's going to be kind of similar to Hurricane Andrew back in 1992. That was a Category 5 hurricane that hit Miami area. Um, my parents lived through that. That was It was really, really devastating um, hurricane, and um, it's going to be bad. So, yeah. Um, to the people that are watching this from Central Florida, like myself, um, it's luckily not going to be as bad for us, but it will be over 100 mile an hour winds for us. Um, I'm going to try to get some videos of this hurricane, guys. Um, and then post them. I'm going to try to make light of the situation that I'm in. Maybe I'll do a video something like how to have fun in a hurricane or something like that. And if I did end up creating that, that probably was posted before this video anyways. Um, 
And yeah, I'm just uh, gonna try to make light of the situation here. And um, if I do end up posting that, I would really appreciate it if you guys did watch those so you can actually see how Hurricane Irma was in Central Florida. Because right now, um, it's forecast to have to go right over my house, the uh, the eye wall, the northeastern quadrant of the eye wall, which is the worst part of the hurricane. It's literally going to be. Um, that's the area where there's the strongest winds, and that's the area where there's uh, the most amount of uh, tornadoes that end up forming there. Because tornadoes form a lot in hurricanes, and uh, that would be bad. So I uh, just wanted to let you guys know about that. Um, I swear to God, if I get comments from people nonstop saying, Ugh, you should have recorded Pixel Gun during the hurricane. I, I, I don't even know what to say. I'll probably just, like, end my life right then and there. I'll just literally walk out inside the hurricane and be like, people have the mental capacity of a half-eaten watermelon, and then just end myself right then and there. But um, hopefully a majority of you guys are smart enough to realize that it's a freaking hurricane that's coming through. I'm still trying to get all my pre-recorded stuff, so I have stuff to post during this thing, but things might be a little bit different during the next week or so. So I don't, I just don't know. Um, anyways, we're not going to really worry about that too much here. We're about six minutes into this video. I'm going to switch to some other weapons here. I'm going to use the balloon cannon. I'm going to use the plasma releaser. I'm going to use the nunchucks. I'm going to use the fidget thrower, the charge rifle, and the missile thrower. Random stuff. And, oh my god, I thought my game crashed for a second. It's so weird. Um, hey, missile thrower kill. Sweet! With this, uh, with this inverted color scheme here, whenever I die, my screen goes black, as you guys have seen. And I, I keep thinking I turn off my screen accidentally, and I'm like, oh my god, no! And then, it, and then I respawn, and I'm like, alright, everything's okay. <laughs> it's weird. It's really weird. Um, I, I highly recommend you guys to try this little challenge out if you haven't done so already. I mean, literally everybody can do this who has an iPhone and an Android, at least. I'm pretty sure other devices have invert colors as an option as well, but you just go into your settings, turn on invert colors, and play Pixel Gun 3D like this, and it's really entertaining. So, uh, yeah. Um... Anyways, guys, we're gonna just continue this on here. We're gonna do as much as we can and still kill as many people as we can. We're at a disadvantage right now. And that guy is killing me with whatever the heck weapon that was. Did I get a kill against him? Can I please get a fidget thrower kill? I'm gonna just literally eliminate fidget spinners, all right? You know, fidget spinners were just were such a stupid meme to begin with. Um, and I'm gonna just, you know, I'm gonna dig their grave right now with this weapon here, getting some kills with this thing. Why am I not getting a kill? Finally! Jeez! Why is everybody taking my kills? Dear lord, literally, I could have killed at least six people there, but everybody's just like, oh, let me just use a one-shot kill weapon, and then they just ruin all of my chances at actually getting points with this. It's so sad. It's so disappointing. Plasma releaser, please do well for me. Oh, you're not doing well for me. You're not doing well for me at all. Oh, my lord, plasma releaser. Come on. Come on, plasma releaser. God dang it, you stupid little... Plasma shooting weapon. I don't even know what I would cl classify you as. There we go. We got a plasma releaser kill. Nicely done. Like for plasma releaser kill, guys. Oh my lord. It's it's not the greatest weapon in the world anymore. It used to be so powerful back in in like 2015. Plasma releaser was like literally the greatest thing in the entire world. And you could do a lot of cool out of the map glitch tutorials with that thing. Um, you could glitch yourself out of Mafia Mansion in that uh, in that with this thing with the plasma releaser, and it was it was cool, guys. I gotta say. I remember I did a video and it was titled something like Amazing Out of the Map Glitch or, or Walk on Top of Map or something like that for uh, Mafia Mansion. I think it was in late 2014 and uh, I it was like the coolest glitch I've ever seen in my entire life. Seriously, it was awesome. Um, but yeah, hey, nunchucks kill. I'm actually doing surprisingly well. I'm probably doing about as well as I did normally. Um, so maybe this isn't the most difficult challenge in the entire world, or maybe I'm just, you know, a fantastic Pixel Gun 3D player, because that's obviously the reason, guys. No sarcasm whatsoever. I'm clearly the greatest Pixel Gun player in the history of all Pixel Gun 3D players. Like, look at this. Look at this. One-shot kill. Bam! Oh, so sorry, but am I really? Oh, another one! Oh, god dang it. Nope, never mind. I'm getting too cocky. God dang it. All right, here we go. Let's go get these guys. Hello, Toonami4! What? You're lagging up a storm there, mate. Come on, I could have taken you out. What is that? Anyways, we've got to focus here. Focus and concentrate and get a couple more one-shot kills against some people with my little charge rifle. Come on, let me get a couple more, all right? Because Soviet Russia can always get little charge rifle kills. We have charge rifles in real life, okay, my friends? And it is pretty good, I must say. Anyways, we're about nine and a half minutes into this video, and I should probably switch to another weapon. I might have gotten another missile launcher kill, but I still have not gotten a balloon cannon kill. So I must do that, okay? We're going to get a little balloon cannon kill and do it for Mother Asher, okay? Mother Asher will end up... Oh my god. 
Oh my god, I'm completely failing right now. God dang it! Come on! Let's go! Let's do it! We can do it! Don't you dare! Yes! Come on, double kill! Ooh! Kill assist! Let's go! Nicely done. I gotta kill with all these weapons, alright? Now we're gonna switch to some other stuff, alright? Rapid fire rifle. Let's use the shotgun pistol. Let's use, uh, the meat grinder. Let's use the electric arc. Let's use the freaking thunder spell. And, you know what? I'm gonna use the judge. Or no, I'm gonna use the nutcracker. Because this is a removed weapon that nobody has. And everybody's like, oh, exotic, use the nutcracker. So, you know what? I'm doing it for you guys. Nutcracker for the win. Let's go. You ever seen an inverted nutcracker gameplay? No, you haven't. Because no other YouTuber has done it before. I'm the first one with an inverted colors nutcracker gameplay. Ain't nobody else done that. Ain't nobody done a nutcracker with the invert colors. Let me tell y'all. It's about the coolest looking little nutcracker that's all that's ever existed in this whole goddamn game. Let me tell y'all. Anyways, alright. Let's go take a couple more people out here. Shotgun pistol for the win. Logan, you, sir, have killed the person I tr- I don't know what I'm trying to say anymore. I'm sorry. I'm focusing way too hard right now. I got another headshot. Did I win? Did I win? Wow, I did not win at all. How? Okay. How did I get 12 kills and that guy, he had the Ghost Lantern. That, I, I answered my question right then and there, all right? If he didn't have the Ghost Lantern, he would have gotten, like, one kill because he sucks at the game. But can we, like, take a second to appreciate, uh, the freaking pool looks like lava in this, in this inverted color scheme? Like, who wants to jump in that? That's scary. My god. Hey, Thomas! How's it going, Thomas? Let me kill you, Thomas! I still killed you. You have the Ghost Lantern. You suck. You're a terrible player. My god. If you have the Ghost Lantern and I still can take you out with this thing, yeah, you you probably should just delete the app, let me just tell you. Anyways, let's just go kill some more people here with my underpowered weapons compared to their ridiculously overpowered ones, making a fool out of themselves. The de get the de dead boy. What 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 type of username is that? The dead boy. I'm the dead boy because exotic gaming keeps killing me. It's not fair. My name is Thomas. And I have to use one-shot kill weapons like the Laser Bouncer and the Ghost Lantern because I can't use anything else. I hope Thomas is watching this, to be honest. I'm basically making fun of him, and I hope he changes. But that's kind of the intention of that little uh, short imitation there. Um, anyways, let's go take out the dead boy. The dead boy! Oh, great. Freaking singular grenade. You know, I haven't really encountered many singular grenades in the past, but um, I guess my luck of uh, running out of those things has ended. I'm going to leave this match because... I'm not about to, to play around with people using the singular grenade. You are a terrible human being if you use that. Anyways, um, let's go use... I'm going to go into White House. Maybe I, I... You know, I haven't gone into White House yet for a video, so I might as well do something a little bit different um, and see exactly how things turn out. So let's go. Who's going to be the first victim? That is the real... Okay. That is the real question. I will see what is uh, this uh, first... Victim! Which direction is, the, is uh, this person? Uh, I don't know, actually. Kind of worrying. Oh, Lord. Where are these guys? I don't know. Oh, man. I really hope you guys actually do like the face cam, though, by the way, because, um, I mean, I, I'm using it in basically all of my videos now. Um, this is, like, the only series, my Pixel Gun videos, where I really don't. So, um, let me know down below what you all think, and uh, I might do face cams for the rest of my Pixel Gun 3D videos. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, hiccuping. Uh, don't hiccup, please. Please, let me kill you! What are you using? What is that weapon? I don't know. It's so weird because whenever I see players, um, and they have that blue name over them, I think they're on a team with me, but they're not because it's a freaking free-for-all, but it's just so weird because, like, there we go. I've gotten a kill with all these weapons. Sweet, I can go switch to some other stuff. But, um, yeah, it's really weird because I, um, I keep thinking they're on my team, but they're not because we're on a free-for-all. Flower power. I wonder, I wonder what the flower power looks like. Santa sword because that's a good trusty weapon. Harpoon gun. Um, let's use the tactical bow because why the heck not? And then lastly, heavy gifter because we always love the heavy gifter guys, alright? Anyways, um, who's gonna be the next guy that we're gonna take out? Let's go find him! If you walk in this hallway, you will end up dying. It's this guy! Come on! Where did you go? What? Okay, I don't know what I just said there, but that guy just disappeared for a second. My blast just, like, covered him, and he was okay. It was like a, a an unintentional smoke grenade. God dang it. Okay, here we go. Hello. Where did you go? Come on, mate. Um, don't you be too drastic here, you absolute bloody idiot. I don't even know what to say anymore, to be honest. I'm just, I'm appalled. I'm appalled at such things that have been occurring right now in this game. Come on! Tactical bow! You haven't hit a single shot! Okay, you've hit two. But that was not enough. That was plenty too little to actually get a kill. God dang it, you stupid tactical bow. Oh, is this the same guy? 
Is this the same guy? Where is he at? What did that just kill me with? The judge? Ah, uh, it's the freaking judge user. Oh, dear lord. All right, here we go. Pencil thrower time. Uh, I don't really use this thing ever, so I don't know what's going to happen here. That's what's going to happen. Okay, all right. We got a pencil thrower kill. What a terrible spawn. Okay, maybe I can get a tactical bow kill. Can I Can I please get a, or a harpoon gun, maybe? Harpoon gun? Nope. Okay, all right. You're just going to use that freaking rail gun. That's a quality human being right there. All right. One shot kill through wall weapon. Yeah, that's really a, you know, wonderful weapon. Anyways, um, here we go. Let's focus here. Let's focus here. Come on. There we go. Spring trap. Spring trap. You're done. There we go. Tactical bow time. Come on. Come in my direction, my friends. Oh my god, I've gotten the Snapchat. That is all oh, great. Can you shoot the pet? Wait, can you shoot that dragon thing out of the way? I swear to god, I just shot it and it just disappeared. But it didn't kill me. That was really weird. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, great. And then he's just using the big buddy. Oh my lord. Okay, here we go. Let's focus. We gotta get a tactical bow kill. We just gotta. We gotta get a tactical bow kill. If we don't, then our whole life existence just, it was for nothing. I need to. I need to. Is it the greatest weapon right now? Oh, yes. Here's my chance. Here's my chance. One more shot. One more shot. There we go. Tactical bow. What you got on me? Nothing, Springtrap. You're going to use a freaking newbie one-shot kill weapon, weren't you? But no. I've shown you. There we go. Flower power. Come on. We have the power of the flower. Did I do it? I got a penalty for death. Are you kidding me right now? But I didn't kill the other guy? It, why does it not register as a kill for me? He clearly died with, when I died. Did the other guy just kill him at the same time or something? Like, what the heck happened? Great, great singular grenade. Leave. 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 All right. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't get to get the uh, special stuff at the end there, but I don't care. I don't really care. Coliseum. All right. Insane map, but it's good for the end of the video. Um, my God. You know, it's actually slightly enjoyable playing like this. I mean, regular pixel gun 3D at this point in time is, is not enjoyable, but like this is, uh, you know, it's slightly enjoyable. And, um, you know, I can actually kind of deal with this somewhat. Just, you know, just doing a regular inverted colors challenge. And it's just like, you know, whatever. Anything that happens. I mean, I can't really expect fantastic gameplay with my colors looking like this. But, uh, you know, it's just, uh, it's fun. It's kind of fun, I have to say. And that's kind of surprising to hear me say that. But uh, it actually legit is kind of fun. Um, but in all honesty, I don't think I have much else I need to really do in this video. We're already 17 and a half minutes into this video. Time is uh, running short, unfortunately. And um, as I say my outro, I'm going to equip just a couple of other weapons. Steam Power, Zombie Slayer. Let's equip the uh, um, the Combat Yo-Yo. Let's equip the... Let's see. What's something that I don't generally use? The Vacuumizer. Let's equip the Gorilla Rifle. And lastly, the Grenadier. So... Here we go, Grenadier time, which still, I'm amazed some people still call Grenader. It's not Grenader, it's Grenadier, guys. Um, if you, you literally look up the pronunciation on Google, it's Grenadier, all right? Um, and then, uh, yeah, that's that's basically it. Um, I'm really happy with how this video turned out. Um, again, I hope Hurricane Irma didn't do too much damage to my house. Um, I'm, I'm still going to hope that I am able to post every single day, get stuff posted for you guys, and then that way it'll be almost as if a hurricane never ended up happening, at least for you guys. For me, obviously, there's no way to prevent that. And it's actually raining outside as we speak. That's the outer rain bands of the hurricane. Sunday is when it's going to hit. It's Friday. I'm pre-recording this on Friday. And, um, yeah, that's basically it. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Make sure to leave a like down below. Make sure to leave a like for good luck from the hurricane, guys, even though the hurricane already happened from the time that I'm posting this. Just just leave a like anyways, guys. Um, and, and, and again, as I always say, if you guys leave enough support on this video, we're going to keep Pixel Gun 3D on the channel. If we just don't, then, uh, well, unfortunately, Pixel Gun might uh, have to go. And... Um, yeah, that's basically it. Subscribe if you're new, guys. Um, hopefully, if you guys want to see more, we'll be having some more Pixel Gun content in the near future. And I just want to get uh, one kill with the Vacuumizer, and then we'll end it off right here. Did I get a kill with the Combat Yo-Yo yet, though? No, I didn't. Let's go Yo-Yo. Yo-Yo. Yo-Yo time. Let's go. Yo-Yo ma. Let's go. All right. Come on. Look at you. Jumping up and down like an idiot. Okay. There we go. There we go. Yo-Yo for the win. Maybe another one? Okay. Maybe not. I was getting a little too excited there. Maybe another one, actually. Not even lying. I might be able to get another one. Nice. And then the Zombie Slayer. Come on. One more shot. One more time. One more kill. I need to get it with the Zombie Slayer. I, I have to get a kill. Yes, I did. Sweet. Okay. Thank you all for watching, guys. And I will see you all in the next episode.